Hi friends, my name is Femi Biwoye. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to use for each statement uh, to display product from a database. First, these are the two records we currently have in our database, so we'll be able to manage this record to give example of how to display it. So we we'll need to make sure that the two records that we had is being added to this list, even though the remaining ones are just um, they are hard coded to it. First, we go to our controller, our front end controller. Then we need to pass the record from the database. So on our index. We need to call our product. Currently, we do not have a product for our front end, but we'll make it a um, back end. Um, uh, we'll make it a back end product model. So we'll call it product, which is this. Fine. Call. So we want to put a condition statement that says if status is active. Well, it's equal one. So we need to pass this to a view. Now we have this on there, so we'll go to our view index. Let's open this view site index. So on our index, we look for featured items. Let's copy this to know where we start from. Good. So, meaning we are looking at. Um, Let me duplicate this to be sure that this is the record, part of the record. Ctrl X. No, I think you have something. Is it polo? Oh, this is one product. So if I duplicate this and say, so now this is what we need to use inside for each statement. So we'll write our PHP code. Products as product. So at the end of our statement, we need to add, we need to close the for each. So in this case, we need to know the feed name in our table. So the name of the product is name description ik. Name description. So the name should be this. Name. So I'll copy this. I think we should have a um, description somewhere. I think this should be named also. Let me add the description beneath it. So 
photo that in the we have we have um, amounts which is for the price available in stock it is availability product condition so we have the amount here and we have the amount here also So I think that is how. So for the image, let's give let's refresh our page first. Saying we do not have description. I think we made a mistake here. Description. Good. So this is our new record, which with the product name of Polo. A description of a clue I put on the price of 2000 so this is correct so since we have two records there so I think the first two record are for the content while the remaining ones are the are coded ones so let me go ahead and remove um, the remaining ones Now we only have our two products.